What's good, Passport Bros? I'm back with another video. I am in Lagos, Nigeria, in a place called Lekki Conservative Center. And it's a, it's a reserve in the middle of the city. It's really cool because usually when you visit uh, different countries and you go to a reserve, it's outside of the city. This reserve is literally in between residential areas. So we're gonna take a tour here. Uh, this is a cool spot to, if you wanna go on a date. This is, you'll be very sweaty though, because you're outside, it's hot, there's a lot of walking, but you see a lot of animals, a lot of monkeys, a lot of uh, snakes, a lot of crocodiles, alligators, whatever you wanna see, birds. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm out here. Uh, I'm going to show you guys how it looks like out here. So if you visit Nigeria, you can, uh, you know, if you visit Nigeria, you can come here. You know, you drive here. It's about 30, 35 minutes, 40 minutes from Victoria Island, um, where almost everything is. So I'm going to show you guys the area. And uh, now I'm waiting for my tour. I'm waiting for my tour. So it should start anytime from now. So we'll see, I'll show you guys the area and so that you guys can know exactly what to expect when you come here to Lekki Conservative Center. I'm also gonna write the name of the place here. I'm gonna write it in the bio and I'm also gonna link their Instagram. So if you guys wanna check their Instagram, I'm gonna link it in the bio, all right? Peace, I'll see you guys on tour.
this place is very, very uh, green. There's a lot of vegetation, a lot of trees, a lot of animals. It feels cooler in the shade though, because now we're in the shade. We're on tour right now, we're on the tour. So, yeah, it's very peaceful here, as you can see. As we take you guys through the conservative center, it's a lot of trees, thousands of trees here. And we're walking on this wooden path, walking on the wooden path all the way down. It's awesome. Let me show you guys more of it. So this is the canopy that goes all the way up. I am not getting on the canopy, but it goes all the way up. How far up does the canopy go? How far does it? How far up does the canopy go? This is four, four hundred and four hundred and one feet. So four hundred and one feet. It goes all the way up, 401 feet. So, some people are going up, but I've done this before, so I'm not going to do it again. <laughs> As you can see, they're looking back. Yeah, so I'm just gonna wait and I'm gonna take you out to the family part. Stay tuned. Enjoy the vegetation. Good guys, I'm trying to multitask here because I got my coconut. This coconut cost me, it cost me a uh, dollar fifty. So I just try to convert everything to dollars in case you guys want to visit. You know how much things cost. This coconut is usually cheaper than that because of inflation, it's now expensive. Um, this is a game called Ludo. So yeah, you could play this game. You just bring your, you bring the chips and you play, right? 
So I try to show you guys around Nigeria because the mainstream media is not gonna show you any of these things. So I try to show you guys these things so you can see and know what's going on. Places to go when you do visit Nigeria. It's a beautiful place, a lot of nature. Um, whatever you need is here. Um, don't let anyone fool you. Don't let anyone say, uh, don't come, it's not safe. Um, it's generally safe, safer than most Western countries uh, per capita. And a lot of you might go in my comment section and, oh, that's not true, blah, blah, blah. I'm telling you what is. Nobody has a gun to people's heads here. Um, now, there are extreme situations that go on every now and then. But again, we don't live by extreme. We go by general, like general everyday life. Um, also, you can play chess. Yeah. Real human chess. If you know how to play chess, come challenge me. Check me. Um, so yeah, as we're walking, I'm gonna keep showing you guys uh, these things. Like I said, there's a lot of walking. From the beginning to here, it's like a 30 minute walk. But this is the park at the back where you can go, you can get a picnic, you can do a barbecue over there. You can bring family, friends. You know, there's a lot of board games. Uh, there's, a, there's an aquarium out here. There's a checkers, you can play checkers out here. There's a lot of like games, board games, that you can play uh, on the ground, like literally. Like I showed you the chess. Where's the chess? The chess back there. Right? You can play checkers. That's a checkers board. So you can play checkers out here. You know what I'm saying? It's cool, right? A lot of fun things to do. And then there's a couple of aquariums here. Well, not aquariums, fish ponds. There's a lot of fish ponds here. Also, you can do your barbecue there. The barbecue pit is in the middle. Let me show y'all. So there's a barbecue pit in the middle where if you want to do barbecue. Just bring your own uh, stuff, right? And then chill and have a picnic. You could just chill here and have a picnic or watch, or watch the fishes, right? There are fishes in here. There are fishes in here as well. So you can feed the fishes. There's another there's another fish pond over there. Um, and I like that uh, Africa is moving towards Africa, the, the continent in general, is beginning to move towards preservation, moving towards recycling. Right? You can recycle your bottles here. Recycle your bottles here and you'll take it and recycle it. Um, there's a lot of stuff going on that you won't see on TV and this is why my channel exists for you passport bros for you guys in the US UK you guys in those countries where you are isolated from what's really going on outside of it where they sell you information based on a narrative propaganda so they can keep you in so you won't see so you won't see a need to leave you be like I live in the US there's no need to leave everything is here which is a lie because you can come to Africa, right? Meet me right here. And we can play some table tennis. We can play some uh, table tennis, man. We can play, right? As you guys call it, ping pong. Who wants to challenge me on a ping pong table, man? Y'all ain't ready. Bring your bats and balls, man. Bring your ping, ping pong bats and ping pong balls kill y'all on the table man y'all ain't y'all ain't ready so i've shown you guys what i wanted to show you guys peace out much love and peace make sure that uh you like subscribe to my channel so you can see more content 
um, of Nigeria. It's very important that you watch my channel so that we can show you the real Nigeria, what you never see on mainstream media, what they'll never uh, show you because I'm on ground, I'm here. So I'm able to show you these things. So there's no better way is for you to live by curiously through me. So in case you want to come, you already know what to, what to expect. Um, everything that I'm showing you is the opposite of what any kind of mainstream media is going to show you because they're never going to show you, you know, preservation parks like this. You know, they're not, if, if they show you parks like this, it's either you're on a safari or somebody killed some animals. You know, they're never going to see anything positive come out of Africa. There's nothing positive that's going to come out of Africa in the mainstream. So it's important that you guys subscribe, watch. I'm not going to be dropping videos every day, at least not yet, because I want to drop, I want to drop ex uh, content that's really, really going to, you know, help you decide if you want to come to Nigeria, um, what you're going to see, the kind of life you can live here. Go watch my previous videos. Uh, I have reviewed Airbnbs, a few hotels. I'm gonna show you guys a lot more. Uh, maybe one day I'll do nightlife, restaurants, real estate is coming too. Uh, so I'm gonna show you guys a lot. So you guys can have an idea of how it really is here. Not what they've sold to you, not what they've told you it is. Uh, and they don't like guys like me because now it's going to open your eyes to what's really going on in the United States. Uh, well, in Africa, rather. So like, subscribe, share this to anyone that you might think want to come. Passport bros, it's really that bad. You need to get out. Get out of the West. Get out of the West. Get your passport and get out of the West. Come to a continent like Africa. Come to a country like Nigeria. And see for yourself see for yourself if the narrative that they sold you is true or not peace guys